Hello, people. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I am pretty well, and you? A little bit better, but still having trouble with my with my throat. But I I'm feel sorry better. for you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Ah, thank you. Yes, it's because you know, speaking doesn't help me in this moment. <laughs> but I have to speak, <laughs> right? I have to do it. Okay, guys, welcome yes. to your class number three. Um, in a moment, you will see the class presentation. I had a problem with the PowerPoint. Give me a moment, guys. I need to fix this. I don't know what happened with the computer. Doesn't want to work. Okay, now it's working. <laughs> Good. Okay, guys. So, is it raining over there? Is it raining? Yes, in my in my house it's raining. Oh, where do you live, Jenny? To teach. I live in Sayapango. Oh, okay. And you, Karen? I live in Ciudad Delgado. Oh, it's near Sayapango and Ciudad Delgado are close. <laughs> yes, it's, it's raining very, very um, hard. Where? Hard. Okay. Yep, it's raining in town in my town in my town. It's raining there too. And where do you live? I live in Sacacoyo, La Libertad. Ah, okay. I live in Los Planes de Renderos, and in this moment it's not raining, but it was raining some minutes ago. Okay, so um, as you can see, we're going to continue with the past tense. Today we're going to focus on questions and the use of useful. Okay, uh, just a reminder, guys, it's important. <clears throat> It's important to finish the section one and section two, okay? To work at the platform. And well, you can see the, the agenda, recalling previous knowledge, WH questions in the past, practice time, and wrap up. Okay. Um, I want you to guys work and think about these questions. <laughs> I'm sorry. When were you born? And where were you born? When were you born? Example, I was born on February 17th, 1993. And you? And you can give an answer, right? <laughs> so can you tell me guys, when were you born? Born, right? You would have been. I was born April 7th in 1987. 1987. 1987. 87. Oh, okay. So you were born on March, you said. Jenny, you said March. Hello, teacher. You said March, right? And uh, April. Oh, on Seven. April. Okay, thank you. Ruth. I was born on November 7th in 1973. Okay, thank you, Ruth. Uh, somebody else? I was born on January 6th in 1981. January 6th, 1981, okay. Francisco? Uh, I don't know, you listen, I have in the, my car because in the uh, the road for my house is, is collapsed for traffic. 
You listening? Yeah, we can listen clearly. Okay, thank you. Okay. I was born on October 12th, uh, 1977. Okay, on October? October 12th. October the 12th, 1977. 77, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Francisco. Okay, Margarita, you raise your hand. <coughs> I was born uh, in October uh, 14, 1969. 1969. 1969. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Good. So, this is the way, guys, we can say our birth date. Okay. Our birth date. We use the preposition on because we are specific with the day, the month, and the year. So, we use on. I was born on February 17th. 1993. But if you mention only the month or only the year, you use in. I was born in 1993. I was born in 2001. I was born in December. I was born in June. Okay? We use in. If we only mention the month or the year. Now, what about the other question? Where were you born? I was born in Ilopango. And you? I was born in San Vicente. Okay, hey, Karen. Sorry, go ahead, Ruth. I Sorry. was born in San Salvador. In San Salvador. Esaú? Sorry, I... I am in the street and, and <laughs> I work yeah, in. Uh, I can see you're walking. <laughs> yeah, I work in the in my uh, neighborhood. So yeah, exactly in my yeah. neighborhood. Okay, uh, where were you born? I born in. I was born in the Ilopango. Okay, in Ilopango. Really? I was born in the hospital, San Bartolo Hospital. <laughs> no, in, in San Martin, sorry. Oh, in San Martin, okay. Yeah, in my house. Oh, really? Ah, in your house, okay. Somebody else? Nubia? Mm. Where were you born, Nubia? But we don't listen to you. I was born in Soyapango. You were born in Soyapango, okay. Luisa? I was born in Santa Ana. In Santa Ana, okay. Evelyn Marroquín. Are you there, Evelyn? Okay, Francisco. I I was born in San Salvador, a uh, maternidad hospital. <laughs> okay, thank you. Good. So, guys, yesterday, remember, we learned the use of was and where. You remember that? So, we yes. use those words to ask this information. Okay, to ask about, okay, ask about your birth date, okay, birth date. Like in your ID or DUI, in your document, it has your birth date, okay, in place of birth date. So now when people ask you, hey, when were you born? You can answer. And where were you born? You can say the place. Okay? Good. <coughs> so 
sorry. Next, in the next slide, we can see the structure of simple past questions with was and where. Okay, the simple past questions, WH. We have WH questions here. So you're gonna help me guys to make some questions. <clears throat> With what, where, when, who, who, why, why. why. Okay, so can you help me to make some questions? For example, why were you sad yesterday? Okay. Hey, Ruth. Why were you sad yesterday? Are you okay? Okay, that could be a question. Why were you sad yesterday? Ah, sorry, that would be why. Why were you sad yesterday? I'm gonna change. Where? Where was? Where were you living a year ago? <laughs> Okay, that could be one. Where was the party? Uh, when your question is out, you are all, you're using the past progressive. Where were you living? Yes, what? <laughs> With e ing. <laughs> yeah. Okay, where was the party? Where were you? <coughs> right? Where were you? Donde estabas? Where were you? When? When was? Remember it's the past. When was the meeting? Oh, great. <clears throat> Who? Who was your friend? Who was your best friend in school? What? What was your favorite game when you were a kid? Right? Okay, let's give answers. Right, I want to change the color. Why were you sad yesterday? <coughs> mm -hmm. Give me a reason. We can say, I was sad. I was sad because my son is sick. Okay, we are talking about the past. We say, my son was sick. Was sick, ah, okay. <laughs> Yeah, but I, I want to, okay, do it. I was sad because my son was, okay, where was the party? Where was the party? Mm. It, it was in the university. Oh, okay. Or it was in the campus, right? Of the university, of course. Where were you? I was in the bathroom. <laughs> Right? <laughs> Where were you? I was in the bathroom. Where was the meeting? It was yesterday. It was around the it office. It was last year. It was yesterday. Okay. When was the meeting? Who was your best friend in the school? 
they are Silvia and Carla. Oh, my best friends were Silvia and Carla. <clears throat> and what was your favorite game when you were a kid? When you were little, what was your favorite game? Do you remember? Do you still remember? Peregrina. Condelero. <laughs> oh. Pilgrims. Jacks. Pilgrims. Jacks. Okay, so I can say my favorite games were in plural, right? My favorite games were Pilgrims, Young, Jack, and Hide and Seek. My favorite one was High and Seek. I loved to play High and Seek, right? One, two, three, and then looking for all the other kids. That was fun. That was my favorite game. Okay, somebody wrote here. Why were you sad? I was sad because I didn't drink. I didn't drink coffee. <laughs> okay. So these are examples of questions with what and, and where. Good. Can I continue? <coughs> yes. Yes, teacher. Good. So now let's learn about simple past information questions, but with other verbs. With other verbs. I have a message. Oh, Ruth says, I was sad because I didn't sleep. I did. I didn't sleep. I think that was the idea. Um, yeah, when I don't sleep, I get angry. I feel angry the, the next day or sad. <laughs> okay, so simple past information questions with other verbs, not the verb to be, other verbs. So the, the structure, we have WH word, did plus the subject plus the verb in the base form. In the platform, there were some conversations that you need to that you needed to complete, right? And it's very important to remember that when we use the auxiliary did, the verb will be in base form. Or the same in negative, didn't. We are using the auxiliary, so the verb must be in base form, okay? No past form, base form. So, let's start with some WH words. Where, what, <clears throat> When, who, why, how, okay, and then what is next? Wish. Okay, okay, so we're gonna add here which. Then what is next? What is next? Did, right? Yes. Did she live? Okay, did, 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 and did. that was video. Okay, now the subject. I, she, she. I, he, she, it, they. Exactly. 
Okay, but now we can we can um make the complete question. For example, where did where did she go? Right? Where did she go? What did you do this morning? Okay. When did you buy that computer? Who did you talk to? Who did you talk to? Okay. Why did you call me? How did you get there? Ah, but here we with with which we need to put um <coughs> an option. Let's see. Um, mm, which game did you like? Did they like? Or did they play? Okay, so if you notice, the verb is in the base form. We have go, do, buy, talk, call, get, and play. Okay, in questions, we have WH word, did, the subject, and then the verb in the base form. Not in the past, in the base form. Why? Because the auxiliary did tells you it's in past. Now let's answer these questions. Are you going to help me? Where did she go? She went to La Gran Vía. Okay. Hmm. What did you do this morning? <coughs> I went to work. I worked. Okay. When did you buy that computer? I buy. I bought two years ago. I bought the puzzle by, I bought it. I bought it two years ago. Okay. Who did you talk to? Who did you talk to? Guastigo. <laughs> I talked to Tigo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Because they call they keep calling people, right? <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna change, right? I talk to this you can say I talk to the supervisor to change the meeting. <laughs> Why did you call me? I forgot to write here the oops to write here the subject and you didn't tell me. I'm gonna change. Why did she call me? I, why did, I would write it here. Why did she call me? Why did she call me? Because she needed to help at the exercise. <laughs> oh, she needed help. She needed help with the exercise. <clears throat> <clears throat> How did you get there? <clears throat> Tell me, please. I went in a taxi. Okay. You can say, I went on a taxi. 
or I took a taxi. Or I got there by bus. <coughs> I got the anyway. I took a taxi. Mm -hmm. Take took. Yeah, the pass of take is took. Good. Which game did they play when they were kids? Soccer. Know. Okay, they play soccer, they play Nintendo. Basketball. Okay. Atari. Safari. Or which what do you say? Atari is the uh is the Nintendo. Oh really? I didn't know. I just knew Nintendo. <laughs> But obviously, no, yeah. you are older than me, so you know. <laughs> okay, thank you. So these are, <coughs> guys, WH questions in the baseball. Can we use the chat to write some examples? Can you write your own examples in the chat, please? Question and answer. Write a question and an answer. Where did she go? Hi, hi. She went to La Gran Vía. Okay, yeah, that's the example is here, but can you make other examples with WH questions over here in the in the chat? Okay, let's see the examples. Where did you work? They went, Jenny, la respuesta in the past, they went to the park. Rude, rude. Where did she visit? Okay, Ruth, you are confusing the bird to be with this just follow the structure I follow the i put i put the the, the birds in the bus and i put was <laughs> yeah the lead was is she visited uh, her yes. family she yes, visited yes, yes. yeah yes i correct <laughs> okay please okay follow the structure Okay, yes, I, will. I think your question is where did we or where did you going to eat? Going, remember, is going to eat is future. Where did you eat or where did you go to eat? Donde fueron a comer? Where did you go to eat? Or where did you eat? Where did you eat? Don't worry, so we are learning. <laughs> Why did you buy that? Oh, because I liked it. What did you do? Why did you do that? <clears throat> Try to write the question and the answer at the same time.
Where did you get the car? That's perfect, Isaul. I got it in the... In marketplace. Uh, where did they go for vacation? They went to the beach. Where did she go? She visited the family. Or she went to visit the family. She went to visit the family. <clears throat> Let's see. What did you do on the weekend? I rested. I rested. Remember the past. The, the answer is in the past. <clears throat> see. <clears throat> Why did you start in the morning? When did you plant this? Was the last day of the month? Oh, okay. I plant in the last day of the month. Where did she go yesterday after classes? She went to the bank. She went to the bank. Okay. Good. What did you eat for dinner? What did you eat for dinner, guys? I had mora soup. I had a soup. My husband doesn't like to eat soup in the in the dinner, but I needed some vitamins. So I made mora soup. <laughs> okay. Good. Good, guys. Now, guys, we're going to continue with another another topic, and this is used to. Miguel, your question, who are, ah, guys, I need to tell you something before we continue. There is one special thing with the question who when there is no subject when there's no subject we uh, put the verb in past not the auxiliary for example ahí Miguel puso Miguel Jarane uh, one example who taught you how to drive who taught you how to drive quien te enseño a manejar who taught you how to drive or who told you that quien te dijo eso who told you that who went with you who called you Okay, in this case, we don't know the subject. We don't know the subject. We are asking for the subject. And that's why uh, the, the structure changes. It's who, right in the past, and company. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Any questions on that? No. Okay. Yeah, teacher, I have a question. Yes, Francisco? In, in the structure, um, uh, when you are, I use who only uh, is only on only the WH question who? Um, only with who and only, only you don't know the subject. Oh, okay. Yeah, because if you know the subject, like we have some examples before. Let me see. When you know the subject, 
the structure is the same as the other. Who did you go with? But it's you, right? Who did you go with? Who did you teach? Who did you or did they talk to? Right? But it's different. Con quien fuiste tú? Con a quien enseñaste? Con quien uh, o con quien hablaste? Pero hay un sujeto, there's a subject, which is you or they. But it's different when you don't know the subject. Like, who kissed you? Right? <laughs> who? Okay, uh, mi pregunta es solo, so, aplica para who? And the obvious question. Yes. Because who is asking who? Right? It's asking for the person. It's asking for the subject. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. you. Good. Thank you. Now let's learn about the use of used to. We use this expression to talk about actions, activities, routines, habits in the past that we had in the past that we used to do. And we have the example here. When I was little, I used to play hide and seek with my neighborhood, with my neighbors, sorry. When I was little, I used to play hide and seek with my neighbors. So in this case, used is in past. Used to, because we have then another verb in base form. When I was little, I used to play hide and seek with my, neighbor, with my neighbors. Can you tell me guys, can you follow this structure and tell me things you used to do when you were little? <coughs> mm -hmm. When I was little, I used to play Jack with my neighbors. With your neighbors, neighbors. Okay, thank you, Rod. When I was little, I used to eat jocotes leaves with lemon and salt. Me too. <laughs> it's delicious. Yes, Karen? It's delicious. <laughs> oh, they are delicious, yes. Okay, tell me, tell me things when you were little. Remember your childhood. Your childhood, your wonderful years of of childhood. When I was little, I used to visit my grandmother. On weekends or every day? On December. Oh, okay. In December. Yes. <laughs> you used to stay with them on vacation. Okay. What else? When I was little, I used to ride bicycle in the afternoon with my neighbors. Wow, oh, that was great. I used to do it too, Ruth. Yes, great. <laughs> Margarita, you used to burn things. You were missing too. When you were little, you used to burn things. <laughs> You are dangerous. Okay, what else? Tell me, guys. Tell me. Francisco. Okay, uh, when I was a little, I used to eat, uh, eat um, charamuscas. Okay, you used to eat. Eat, perdón. Aha, uh -huh, okay, you eat charamuscas. You know what? I didn't like charamuscas so much, but I used to eat a choco banano every day in the afternoon. 
Oh, yes, I used to eat chocolate banana <laughs> a lot. Eh, Adriana. Eh, well, eh, when I was a child, I used to eh, ring the bell and then run away. <laughs> In the houses, right? Ring the bell yeah. and run away. <laughs> you used to ring the bell. Adriana. I it was Adriana, right? Another person? When I was a little, I I eat it. Uh, I eat. What is the pronunciation? Eat. Eat. Yeah, eat. I used to eat. I used to eat. Okay. I used to eat guindas with lemon. Wow, guindas with lemon. <laughs> Renato. When I was a little, I used to play soccer with my cousins. Great. Eh, Nubia. When I was a little, I used to play soccer with my cousins. Or, or Nubia, we cannot hear you well. Can you repeat, please? <coughs> we listen to you like far away. When I was little, I used to follow songs of different colors. You used to? Okay, maybe you can type it in the chat because I, I couldn't understand. Okay, but thank you, Nubia, for your participation. Oh, Rule, you used to fly. Biscuchas. <laughs> okay. Great. In October, right? <laughs> okay, very nice. Now, um, four questions. Let's see. Nubia, when I was little, I used to collect oh, stones of different colors, stones. Yeah, I, I also, I used to do that too but not only with the colors, but also with the shapes. And I still do it. I still do it. <laughs> when I go to a place and I look for the beautiful stone, I take it. Now that is with affirmative sentences. Um, now let's play negative. And um, when I was little, let me see, I'm gonna write here. Negative. I didn't look used to worry about the time and money. When I was little, I didn't worry about the time and money. When I was little, I didn't like chicken soup. That's weird, but I didn't like chicken soup. When I was little, I didn't used to, I didn't used to like papaya. I didn't used to like papaya. But now it's my favorite fruit. Oh, the yellocos. <laughs> yeah, my brothers used to collect them too. We had a lot of yellocos. Great. Okay, you used to collect coins, okay. Okay, now tell me about things you didn't used to do. For example, I didn't used to worry about the time and money, but now that I'm an adult, I have responsibilities. We worry, right? <laughs> so tell me, what 
didn't used to do. Okay, the structure is I didn't use to. plus the verb in base form. Uh -huh. I didn't use to um, drink tea, but now I I I do. <laughs> really? Okay. <laughs> okay. So great. I did. Uh -huh. I didn't use to drink a uh, coffee, but now all time to drink a coffee. <laughs> Yeah, I agree with you. Francisco? Okay, uh, when I I was little, I didn't, I didn't used to go to the market alone. <laughs> That's right. That's right. Okay, great. Very nice. <clears throat> okay, so that was the negative form. Now for questions, to make questions is very similar with the others, right? Do you use to? And then you say the verb in base form. Do you use to? <laughs> Esau didn't use to wash the dishes. Okay, Esau, it's just use. <laughs> You didn't use to visit the cemetery. <laughs> yeah, it's very sad. Evelyn? Evelyn? Hello. Hello. Yes? Yes, yes. Uh, did you use to? They used to do. Um, eh, wrong, wrong. Okay. Mm -hmm. <coughs> okay. Thank you. Okay. You used to run when you were a kid. That could be a question. Do you used to sleep in the afternoon? Because I remember I used to sleep in the afternoon. <laughs> okay. Another question. Do you use do you use to um eat vegetables? Okay. Do you use to eat vegetables? When you were the a uh, little kid, uh, Francisco. Hey, hi, teacher. I have one question. Uh, uh... When I do use in the answer in the question, do you used to? No lleva la de, no sé cómo decirlo en inglés. ¿Por qué cambia? Because uh, we, have the past. we have the auxiliary. We have the auxiliary did. So when you have the auxiliary. The verb is in base form. The oh, verb okay. is in base form. Okay, use the verb. Base form. Yes. Okay. Yes, yeah. that's the verb. The main verb. Okay, mm -hmm. you. Do you use to run when you were a kid? Do you use to sleep in the afternoon? Do you use to eat vegetables? Okay. 
Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, Margarita says, do you used to go out when raining? When it was raining? It's how I didn't use to eat vitamins. And now we have to, we have to take vitamin B. Vitamins B, right? We need help. <laughs> okay. Good example. Have another one. I didn't use to go to the doctor, but now I need for health and control. Do you used to work on, on Saturday? On Saturday. No, I didn't used to work on Saturdays, but now I'm working on Saturdays. Okay, Ruth, don't forget Ruth. After didn't is use, not used. It's base form. Okay, base form. Great, guys. So thank you. Thank you for your ideas. Thank you for your participation. Do you have another question, Francisco? No. All right. Good. So, guys, before we finish today, we are going to have a game. Okay? The game will be a review for what we have studied these days with the past, with the simple past. So just give me a moment because I'm looking for the game. <clears throat> in a moment, guys, in a moment. Okay. Good. Can you see it? Okay. Yes. Let's choose a number. Let's see. Uh, I'm uh, going to say two. Ten. Seven. Thirteen. <laughs> a lot of numbers. Let's start with the two. Oh. What is here the correct verb in past? Was. Mm. Where? Mm. What is the action? But I girl. don't know how in past. Girl. Exactly, the girl hugged her mom. That's correct. Okay, somebody said 13, okay? Over the weekend, we visited grandma and grandpa. Oh, that's correct. Okay, somebody said number 10. Walk. I walk. But it but what is the pronunciation of walk in the walk. 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 What? Walk. Remember when we started? Walk. No. Walk. <laughs> Remember the three forms. Walk. And walk. 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 I walk walk across the street. I walked across the street. Okay, let's see number seven. Seven. <laughs> okay, another number. Let's say sixteen. <coughs> Brush. 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 Last a great pronunciation. Last night he brushed, 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 brushed. Number four, win twenty five points. Okay. <laughs> Number three, the girl called, 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 called her friend on the phone. Yes, yeah. called her fifteen. Jumping. Jump. Jump. 
Jumped. 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 I jumped on the bed. Do you used to jump on the bed? Yes. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I used to jump on my and dangerous. Parents. And it was dangerous too. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Six. I know. Yes. Shop. Shop. Okay. The boy and his Both. mom. Both. 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 The boy and his mom. Boy. Bow. 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 Okay, we can we could have bought or we could have shopped, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. carry it. The boy and his mom carry Yeah, yeah, no. carry The boy and his mom carry it. Carry it because they are carrying, right? Carry it. The groceries in the house. Okay. Hey. I dance. I dance. I like them. I like them. The music, so so I dance. I dance. So I dance. 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 Number one. Paint. 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 A picture. Paint. Yes, painted. Paint. I painted. Paint it. Paint it a picture. Yes. Last week. Listen. 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 Okay. Last night. Wrote. I wrote. Study. 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 I studied <laughs> the flower. The flower smelled. Smelled. Smelled good. Yes. It's a regular verb. Great. <laughs> nice. Um, <laughs> I just yeah. noticed that I didn't take the attendance. I didn't take the attendance. So I'm going to take you right now. Okay. Be ready. And give me a moment. I'm looking for the list. Thank you for the reminder, Blanca. Believe me that I didn't remember. <laughs> okay. The first person on the list is Gret Adriana Gonzalez. Here. Okay. So this is this was better for the latecomers. Ana Silvia Rodriguez. Absent. Blanca Guadalupe Benavide. Yes, teacher. Eh, Blanca Margarita Vara. Blanca Margarita. I don't hear you. Sorry. <laughs> Brian Hyverson. Absent. David Mejia. David Mejia. Da... Esaú Ismael. Yes. Present. Evelyn Janet uh, Carroquín. Present teacher. Francisco Villafuerte. Present, teacher. Okay, Glendy Elisette Flores. Present. Okay, Glendy. Giselle Marie Hernandez. Giselle Marie. Okay, absent. Um, Iris Janet Martinez. Present teacher. You it is? Isaura Evelia Vasquez. I'm here, teacher. Hiron Naaman Moss. 
present. Josué Miguel Portillo. Present. Thank you. Karen Elizabeth Bernal. Present, teacher. Hey, Karen Ivette Villanueva. Here, teacher. Okay. Kenya Vanessa. Present, teacher. Thank you. Leslie Victoria. Present, teacher. Okay. Luis Ariana Guerra. Present. Mayra Patricia. I'm here, teacher. Great. Nerlin Jaciel Flores. Present, teacher. Oh, thanks. Ninrod Saúl. Guzmán. Present. Okay. Eh, Nubia Cristina. Present. Mm -hmm. And Oscar Alexander. Santana. Renato Salvador Ramírez. Present. Ruth Noemi Beltrán. Present teacher. Thank you. Jenny Carolina Ardón. Present teacher. Okay, guys. Yes, thank you. Thank you for connecting on time. Thank you for your participation in class. It was a pleasure to see you. And I will see you tomorrow, right? We have class tomorrow, Friday. So have a great night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. See you.